Okay, folks, here's Mercedes Sprinter 2.0, obviously gas engine if you're looking at a spark, spark plug, but this is a 2022 Sprinter with about 30,000 miles. And I got the bad news that I needed to change the spark plugs. And then the worst news is the bill that Mercedes wants to do it. It's insane. So I had to do it myself. I'm not really thrilled about it, but um, for $800, I think it was, not to mention the transmission fluid they wanted to change, which I'll have a future video on. I had to give these spark plugs a shot. Well, I think I found the cheapest place in the country to buy these plugs. The dealer wanted 32 and change plus tax. I got them for like 17 and change plus shipping, but I had to ship a belt, which I just changed, my serpentine belt. I got a video for that as well if you want to take a look. Real easy. I'm talking six minutes and your serpentine's done. Anyhow, I'm going to tear the whole top end of this engine off and get to the spark plugs which are buried down in there it couldn't be a normal vehicle and just pop them out and put them in we gotta tear the whole thing apart so all this stuff will be coming out i've done some of this before with my diesels <clears throat> previous diesel sprinters and it's somewhat the same um i'll you know explain these little clips later <clears throat> most of the, most of these are pretty easy and you've seen videos on them but I'll start pulling it apart. I got to make multiple videos. There'll be one, two, you know, different parts down below in the body. You can click along to get more information. Um, right now, I'll just show you the source for these plugs, which I already showed the source for the belt. I just changed. But here's the plugs. You always want to double check their work. All my plug serial numbers match. I'm going to check the gap as a standard practice, but I've almost never needed to gap a plug in my life. But, um, here is the price on plugs. You need four for this little 2.0 four-cylinder turbo gas. $17.40. That's the cheapest price I could find on the planet. Shipping wasn't bad. These guys are pretty cool. They are the best price that I have found. If you find a better price, please let, please let me know. But I've bought a few things from these guys, and they've blown other companies out of the water so far. And this is OEM stuff, as you can see, <clears throat> right from a dealer. All right, I hope that helps you guys. You're going to need a special 14 millimeter socket wrench. I bought this one on Amazon. There'll be links down below to everything. I hope it helps you guys. And again, appreciate it. Like some subscribes and look down below in the body of this video to show you part two, three, and four, and five if necessary. Talk to you later. Appreciate it.